All right, folks, Thursday morning, we're one day out from the big November jobs report. And right now, everything's pretty much in a holding pattern leading into that number. Very, very quiet overnight session in the equities. Where's the excitement right now? FX, look at the currency market. Look at the dollar just getting crushed over the past couple of days. Right now, the euro trading up above one spot 21. The pound dollar now up above one spot 34, working its way up towards one spot 35. This is a two and a half year low in the dollar and a lot, a lot of movement in that market uh, coming off the back of this election in early November. Something to keep an eye on there. Oil. We talked about that OPEC Plus meeting getting delayed until today. We should get an announcement today as far as what OPEC Plus is going to do with production moving forward. Right now, leading into that uh, meeting, oil still still hovering right around $45 a barrel in WTI. Not much movement, but that announcement, again, should come today. Could see some excitement in that market. With the weakness in the dollar, we're seeing gold trade higher this week as well. Again, uh, up above that uh, $1,800 an ounce level, uh, reversing some of that weakness that we saw over the past couple of weeks. Due to be another exciting day, we do have initial jobless claims coming out this morning at 8.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Uh, so there's some headlines there. Uh, other than that, again, big economic number tomorrow with that November jobs report. So let's go out there. Let's get after it. And I'll check in with you folks again tomorrow.